Our body is designed to naturally detoxify itself, but with constant exposure to toxins from the food we eat, to the air we breathe, to the products we use not only on ourselves, but also in our home, our body is being bombarded with toxins and they can easily start to accumulate. The good news is there are things that we can do every day to help our body in this natural detoxification process and help alleviate some of that burden. In this video, I'm going to share some of the things that I like to do to encourage this process. Drinking plenty of water throughout the day is one of the most simple ways to help the body detox. The body releases toxins through the bowels, urine, and sweat, all of which require plenty of water. Something that's helped me drink more water on a daily basis is having water with me at all times, everywhere I go. This is the stainless steel water bottle I use. It's 64 ounces, so I fill it up twice a day and I make sure to drink all of it before the day is over. It not only serves as a visual cue, but it also helps me track how much water I'm drinking throughout the day. Breathing detoxifies the body, and the way we breathe matters. When we have poor breathing habits such as shallow chest breathing, there's less oxygen available to our cells, and this slows down the flow of blood that carries waste. So it's important to take more deep, conscious breaths. As you breathe in, you should feel your belly expand, and as you exhale, feel it contract. And a good tip I've learned is to spend more time on the exhales. This helps remove old, stagnant carbon dioxide that's left at the bottom of the lungs. The tongue is another place toxins can accumulate, especially all night long while we're asleep. If you've ever noticed a white film on your tongue in the morning, that's an accumulation of food debris and bacteria. And it's the common cause of bad breath. And if nothing is done about it, those toxins are reabsorbed into the body. So that's where a tongue scraper really comes in handy. I use a tongue scraper every morning and night after brushing my teeth. And I scrape my tongue about 10 times, making sure I get every area. Dry brushing is an ancient Ayurvedic practice that consists of literally brushing your skin to stimulate the lymphatic system and help clear out toxins. The skin is the largest organ of the body, and dry skin brushing can help the body open up this channel of elimination. So using a natural bristle brush, you start at your feet and brush upward, always moving towards the heart. And I'll put a link to a guide that explains this in more detail, but the idea is to continue moving up, brushing each part of the body. And once you're finished, it's recommended to take a shower to help wash off all the dead skin cells. Exercise encourages circulation and helps toxins move along as well. Especially when you work up a sweat, the body will release those toxins through the pores of the skin. And the great thing about exercise is that it comes in many forms, so the type of exercise you choose is entirely up to you. The important thing is to get the body moving. Another simple way to detoxify is by oil pulling. This is basically just swishing oil in your mouth for several minutes. So you can think of this like a natural mouthwash. It's best to do this first thing in the morning. You just put a tablespoon of coconut oil in your mouth and start swishing it around. You can start by doing this for just a couple of minutes and then with regular practice, build up to 20 minutes. I know it sounds like a lot of time, but you can do this while you're getting ready for your day. And once you're done, make sure you spit this out. You don't want to swallow this because it's full of toxins and spit it out in a trash can to avoid clogging your sink. Getting enough sleep every night also helps in the body's natural detoxification process. I recently learned of a toxic protein called beta amyloid, which is known to accumulate in the brains of those with Alzheimer's. And studies show that sleep helps clear out this toxic protein from our brain when we sleep. So that's just one example of how sleep is a very important part of the body's natural detox process. Quality sleep allows our body to reset, recharge, and eliminate those toxins that accumulate throughout the day. Eating more fiber-rich foods can also help our body in this process. Many toxins tend to hang out in the colon area, especially when we're eating a lot of unhealthy and processed food. So foods high in fiber like leafy greens, fruits, whole grains, legumes, all of these will help get things moving along in the digestive tract, helping our body eliminate more easily. 
Adopting a mostly plant-based diet has really helped me achieve this because I'm eating a lot of these foods on a daily basis already without having to put so much thought into it. Something as simple as a self-oil massage can optimize the body's natural ability to remove toxins. This is very similar to dry skin brushing. It helps increase the flow of blood and lymph, and this in turn helps clear waste products from the body. I'll add a link in the description box with more details on how to do this, but I really enjoy doing this every night. It's also a nice way to wind down and relax and show yourself some love. Detoxing is not only for the body, but also the mind. Everything in our body is interconnected, so it's important to also take care of our mental and emotional health. And a great way to do that is by meditating. I like to set aside some time each day to just sit and just focus on my breath. Sitting in silence for a few minutes every day has helped me calm my thoughts and as a result, reduce stress. I have found that the more I do this, the more I train my mind to stay present not only when I sit down to meditate, but also in everyday activities, which is a very helpful tool to have, especially in this busy world we live in today. So I'd love to know how many of these things are you doing already? Let me know in the comments section. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you and I will see you very soon.